everybody. Uh, I'm Francesco and I've been major for the last 10 years. Uh, the, question, the question that we answer is still available is uh, who does what in the industrial world? Uh, might be surprised, but actually it's not a, an easy question. You can go on Google and uh, you find information that are not verified. What we provide is still available are uh, trusted information about uh, who are the suppliers who actually can make certain type of products uh, and how reliable they are. We set up our space in the, uh, yeah, in the industry 4.0 uh, framework, uh, helping, uh, starting from the procurement, helping uh, stakeholders to generate and manage data in order to uh, unlock uh, value that is hidden in the supply chain. And we want to accompany the industrial IIoT up to the predictive maintenance. Uh, our market uh, is a um, steel market uh, and we focus on the high end of the market which is actually the energy industry. It's a market worth 320 billion US dollars a year, 75% is in Asia Pacific. And we focus at the moment on uh, 12 different uh, categories of commodities, but we are planning to add uh, more on, on the platform. Uh, I personally experienced in the last 10 years how fragmented and non-transparent this market is. Uh, even uh, Alibaba tried to bring visibility to this industry, but eventually they attracted mainly low-end players and a poor customer experience. Uh, so, to, so, to find a new supplier and identify his expertise is still an issue uh, today, making uh, this job uh, time-consuming and having uncertain uh, results. On the other hand, uh, a supplier, this was my experience before, receive a lot of inquiries that are not uh, uh, refer to this capacity, and uh, it's difficult to find a new channel, a new tool that allow you, allow you to have uh, new clients and new business opportunities. Uh, the approach we are still, still available is by providing valuable information, and uh, we uh, reduce the uh, information asymmetry in the typical of this market, and we generate new value for all the players. Uh, to do so, we already have a, a platform that is, uh, is running, and we have spent the last few months uh, validating it uh, uh, together with uh, some uh, key stakeholders. Uh, at the moment, we are mainly focused on a customized product, where the key uh, point is the real information about the expertise of the key players. By the end, by the end of next year, we are going to be able to and also uh, uh, on, li on live information about the stocks available of standardized products, uh, allowing us to access another area of the market with a, with a smaller uh, value orders, but a much faster sales cycle. Uh, thanks to our uh, network of trusted suppliers, we already received uh, over 65 uh, inquiries in the first six months of 2016, worth 85 million US dollars. Uh, and uh, and uh, we are going to generate uh, uh, revenues for uh, 1.2 million uh, Hong Kong dollars this year. Uh, we believe uh, in a marketplace that is a network enabler, which means uh, all the stake stakeholders, suppliers, clients, and uh, service providers will bring the value uh, in this platform in a uh, creating an ecosystem that actually generates value for the ecosystem itself. And uh, eventually we are trying to add more and more end-to-end -end integration to APIs. We already achieved some uh, partnership with some key, key uh, suppliers in, uh, for insurance, freight, uh, and especially quality services that are key, key point for, uh, for this industry. Uh, the revenue stream are quite simple, commission based on a uh, finalized deal plus uh, added value services and uh, premium subscriptions. Uh, the key uh, competitive advantages that we have are two, the categorization of the goods and the uh, list of our pre-qualified vendors and a tool that eventually will help us to pre-qualify more and more vendors. Uh, the team. We believe that uh, our team is the right one to make it possible. We have a, a different set of skills. We know each other for the last 10 years. Uh, uh, meeting each other in Asia, we have all been working in the B2B industry and uh, we bring all a uh, good network of uh, contacts that together uh, with the network of the, the business developers that we are hiring will make faster the sales cycle. 
uh, we are currently uh, self-funded, but uh, we are also fundraising, and we hope by the end of this year to achieve 1.5 million US dollar to work on the product development to increase uh, online and offline marketing and uh, add more, more people to the team. Thank you very much. So, so I'm, I'm, I'm not really quite clear what you do. You're a marketplace for the resale of steel, is that correct? Uh, okay. The original uh, idea was to have a pure marketplace where you actually need supply and client. Uh, then we realized that uh, the market needs also some other tools. So we have a database of supplier and products, and we have a matching algorithm that uh, uh, allow the clients uh, to post the inquiries uh, like uh, you can go on uh, 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 booking.com and then uh, the system generates you some uh, leads uh, some, uh, in, the, in the way that you don't have to go to a long list of su potential suppliers but we already indicate the supplier that are suitable for your uh, requirement. Regarding the business model, you mentioned the uh, commission, right? How do you know the amount of the the transaction is is it payment happening within your platform or uh, because mm -hmm. somebody can no. sell for one million yeah, exactly. and they to you ten thousand yeah so for for customized products uh, usually not because the value is too high so what is important is the relationship with the supplier and uh, also the from the legal point of view uh, so we're quite confident on this we don't want to have too many suppliers at the moment we work with 50, 50 suppliers that are uh, some of the market leader in their own segment uh, and they generate already revenues for over uh, four to five uh, billion. It's trust basically. Just for the customized, but uh, the next point where we do more automation is when we can list uh, stock availability uh, worldwide. And these are range of uh, um, um, quite a much smaller you can actually manage to uh, close offline. Online, sorry. So creating a marketplace is really, really hard. Um, you really need to stand out um, compared to the competition. Could you be very sharp about what sets you apart from the competitors? Okay. Uh, this market is very conservative, and uh, most of the marketplaces that are out there and are generating some, some revenues are purely classified. The business model is bringing more and more suppliers on board without any visibility of what's happening after the client is looking for them. That's it. What we, generate, what we want to do is actually generating value in terms of performance that we provide. We, we realize that the key point, other than the security of the data, because even the information on, on the inquiry for the clients are actually part of their know-how, the other key point is that everything that is related to quality, which means pre-qualification of supplier up to a vendor scorecard, and in between all the uh, quality control that you have to perform, third part inspection, preloaded inspection, and this will be the key part. We'll integrate seamlessly these kind of services together on, uh, on our platform. So we'll get gen revenues on the sales of the products, but we also um, get revenues from the service that we provide uh, together with, uh, with those uh, uh, products. Yeah, I'm going to ask. Where are the buyers mainly located? The buyers that are interested in are mainly uh, in Asia, especially in South, uh, Southeast Asia. Because there are uh, new supply chains where they are more and more interested to, to find new suppliers. And we mainly focus at the moment with suppliers that are out of Asia. How do you reach out to these potential buyers? Uh, we already have a long list of, of, uh, of buyers that we met through our network. And we, are, we have found a few business developers in each in each market they will help us to speed up uh, as a uh, research. Obviously, we also do uh, a lot of online marketing, but uh, in this industry, as is a conservative, and we need to find a decision maker in each company. We're going to have a more and more content marketing strategy, and then going to, uh, to present paper in different exhibition. 